Hi, I'm U.S. Senator Mike Crapo, Chairman of the Senate Banking Committee. It is a pleasure to be able to share some remarks with you, although I wish it could have been in person. CDFIs have played a pivotal role in supporting businesses, families, and individuals during this challenging time. Through your tremendous efforts during this pandemic, many have become aware of the presence of CDFIs in their states and all the important roles they are able to play in their local communities. When the Paycheck Protection Program was initially being implemented, there was, understandably, some confusion and challenges associated with the ability of small business owners to receive attention and assistance from some of the larger lenders. However, I have consistently heard positive news and wonderful success stories about CDFIs in Idaho and across the country and their responsiveness to the small business community. While certainly great to hear, it was definitely not a surprise to me. I have long known the important role that CDFIs play in our local economies. Dave Glazer and his team at MoFi have been great to work with, and I am glad to see them continue to expand their presence and success in Idaho. I have had the opportunity to visit a number of the projects in Idaho that have been supported by the New Markets Tax Credit and have been a longtime supporter of the New Markets Program. As you know, that credit remains one of the traditional tax extenders that is currently set to expire at the end of this year. I continue to push for an end to this inefficient way of managing an important part of our tax code. We should make permanent those temporary provisions like the New Markets Credit, which have a proven and justified worth to remain in the code. I will continue to press for policy solutions that will help us weather the storm and provide the financial sector with the flexibility it needs to meet borrowers' needs. More may be required from you before this crisis is over, but I know that you are up to the task and that we will eventually return to a robust, healthy economy. Thank you again for having me and keep up the good work.